roll, roll with you guys. I Hit that thumbs up for these videos, guys. Welcome to another New York video, boys. <laughs> Hopefully you guys are enjoying some of the new look, <laughs> new setup, Hypermotard. We will be pulling up with a couple of more bikes, so keep an eye out. rip boys little rip hopefully all is well with you guys i do have a new a brand new motorcycle joining the channel stick around so you guys can see what the bike is if you guys know or if you can guess it comment in the comment section let me know what you think it is the bike's been ordered for a few months now just been kind of waiting for it and um bike is already in the US however there was a dealership mix up they shipped my bike to the wrong dealership so now I'm waiting for it to be shipped back to New York so I can get it so. I am running a 27,000 subscriber giveaway on the channel trying to get to 30,000 so once we've hit that I will announce a winner <laughs> hit that thumbs up for these videos guys it's really an amazing opportunity to bring back the New York City videos and uh, us rocking around on some of these new bikes and I know you guys have seen the KLX 140RL me the practicing wheelies and that is gonna translate to these bikes <laughs> which I have I just want to be very comfortable before doing them big fan of the Ducati Hyper Motard. You're probably noticing things are a little bit different on this bike. Handlebar wise, um, basically the uh, hand guards, the turn signals, all that stuff is gone. I decided to change up the bike a little bit. I personally I feel like the bike was a bit of a flex having the hand guards I don't go off road I don't do any of those things and for um, so the kind of riding that I do I don't think it's something that I need I took that off also it made it extremely awkward uh, riding the bikes through New York City um, as soon as I pull off the hand grips and the turn signals I realized the handlebar was huge I mean I guess part of a mental thing. The handlebar is pretty large. 
about 33, 33 and a half inches wide, and it had little gaps at the far end to, to kind of hook the uh, the wrap around turn signals. That's why I mean the bike kind of awkward for me to lane split through New York City, and it took me a while to kind of figure that out. But this setup here is really, really dope. I got a bar in on the right hand side of the bike. I have my bar in mirror on the left hand side of the bike, which works perfect for me. I also did a quick shifter up and down auto blip, quick shift and auto blip. So this thing is set up, man. I've also did reservoirs, rear brake. this bike. ride the bike like how I rode my other bikes now. It's kind of weird how something so small made such a big change, man. 